What is up boys and girls, welcome back to another Aoki Tuber. Today we're going to be playing some Lux support in Season 14. Because guys, I'm going to be real, I feel like I've been neglecting this champion. She is generally strong in every single elo, sitting at a 50 to 52% win rate. Just kind of depending on the elo. A little bit stronger than in, in lower elo TBH. But um, yeah, Lux is the quintessential, she was the original support. You know what I mean? Like the support that takes all the kills you know, manages the wave, one-shots everybody, while the ADC's kind of just, like, sitting there with their thumb in their butt. But, um, yeah, she's she's good, guys. She's got CC, she's got great poke, she has excellent scaling, and uh, it, it's pretty crazy because everything on paper should kind of lend Lux to being a little on the weaker side this season. Like, Zaxax Zax just got nerfed this patch. Um, we've got... Luden's Tempest or Luden's Companion, which is basically a downgraded version of Luden's. So, like, why is Lux strong? Like, she. Everything kind of seems like she shouldn't really be that strong. This guy's dead. Up. Oh. Love it when they panic flash. Love it when they panic flash after they're already dead. But, um, yeah, I. I Honestly, I don't really have like a concrete answer for you guys. I don't know why Lux is so strong other than just, I guess, damage is crazy this season. But we're going to be showing you guys how to carry with this deceptively strong champion. We got CC, we got poke, we got utility, shields, uh, everything. Everything you kind of want. Everything you would want. I don't know if it's everything your, your ADC would want, but we don't really care what they want, do, they? do we? Alright, so I actually like the Lux into Rakan because my Q will straight up stop him in his tracks. So if I can kind of like predict where Rakan is looking to hard engage on us... Pretty easy to just like Q him out of his uh his W. We're gonna put that there. Boom. Oh, he just blocked my shield. Also, I'm lagging today. I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know why my uh my internet decided to lag on the day that I dis you know, the day that I'm playing the, the champion with nothing but skill shots in their kit. But it's okay. Bye bye. We can kill this guy too. He has no W. And he has nobody to E to, so he's just kind of dead. Realizes that now? I don't even know how I got that one, boys. <laughs> that's just the secret passive of uh that's just the secret passive of Lux, is sometimes kills just fall into your lap. Oh my god, I'm at 150 ping. Guys, if we can dominate laning phase like this, playing at like 10 times the ping I normally do. Maybe the champion's broken, boys. All right, so we're just going to go for a standard build and max path, or a skill order path. I'm just going to be max and RE. E into Q max is always really, really good. There's some metas where it's like you're building like straight up enchanter Lux, and you're going to max your W first, but we're not in one of those guys. We are straight up in a damage uh, kind of focused meta right now. Uh, full runes, guys. We've got Arcane Comet, Manaflow Band, Transcendence, Scorch, Biscuit Delivery, Cosmic Insight, AP, AP, Scaling Health. The way. Yeah, this is genuinely, uh, I think the title of this video is going to be Why is Lux so broken in Season 14? And I'll be honest with you guys, I don't have a direct answer. Like I said, everything on paper feels like she should be a little bit on the weaker side. But she's not. She's absolutely not. Alright, this is going to be good because I'm going to have my Q in two seconds. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, wait, wait. I'm coming for the Penta. I'm coming. I'm coming for the Penta! Oh, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Uh, all right, so as for build, we're going to be going for Ludent. I told you guys, Lux Support is the one that takes all the kills. She is the KSer support. I can't believe that just happened, bro. Uh, she's going to be in big trouble if she presses W. Oh, my God. Briar, get out of there. Briar, run! 
Oh, wait. Oh, wait. It was actually a good play. I thought she was about to get, like, Omega collapsed on by my entire team. I'm gonna try to do, like, a max range there. Oh. Okay, they're, they're out of sync with each other. I missed my Q on her. Uh, get him rooted there. Bring her into my E. Now nah, we're chilling here. You got Yas. Still got my passive on him. Boom, passive, easy. Dude, this is a bloodbath. What is going on? What is going on? I'm, I'm starting to get a little used to the uh, the ping. Also, before anyone complains about me complaining about my ping and saying like, yo, I play from the moon. I normally play with 200 ping. Why is he complaining? Guys, ping is something where like I normally play on like 20, 25 ping, 30 ping. It's not, it's not that I have like an unplayably high ping right now. It's that it's like 10 times higher than it normally is. Going from low ping to high ping is like, that's that's the worst part, you know? Back in college, I used to play on like 150 ping. I think I'm dead, unfortunately. Oh, nice. So notice I don't always instantly pop my E. It's because it kind of wastes it if you do that. The E just like constantly reapplies slows. So unless you need the damage in your passive dam- Oh. Passive damage like right then and there. Like, it's kind of just better to leave my E there. So that, uh, she's just constantly slowed while she's in the field. Oh, jumped over my, my Q. Dude, this is such a chaotic game. I'm, like, at a loss for words. I don't think I've ever been this fed on Lux. Bro, I have my entire Luden's companion. This is unbelievable. Garner. Got him perma slowed. Auto. Yep, he's dead. Alright. Don't get hit by that. Ah, I wasn't able to get my E on him. Alright, we need to get out of here, bro. I need to go get my full Ludens. Bro, what is happening in this game? This is just chaos. I'm afraid of her ulting me here. Like that. Dude, how did people ever get hit by Briar ult? That seems like the easiest freaking thing to dodge. And that was a close one. But sometimes I wonder that. Like, when I play Briar, I'm having to, like, look forward, like, five seconds in the future just to, like, potentially land it. It's just like, how do people get hit by it? All right, we got full Ludens, boys. I have my full Ludens before level six. I, I, I don't know, man. This champion is, uh... This champion's crazy. Oh, that's a great Skarner ult into the turret. Okay. Dude, their bot lane has died 10 times. It's kind of wild. Sorry, uh, 11 times. Alright, I'm level 6 on this. Should be able to get some Wumbo one-shots. Clear this in. Crash it. Or ganks in bot lane, huh? Alright, Briar is top. Looks like she's probably gonna... T Timo's fine. T Timo should be fine. Timo's very, very good at uh, playing against Briar because he can just blind her. Oh. Easy. Alright. Slick bot. Keep running, bro. Keep running. Oh my god. No, we got him with the Q. Uh 
Uh oh. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Yone's coming. Rakan is very close to death here. Alright. There we go, baby. All right, I'm coming for you, Rakan, too. Sorry, guys. I'm like, I'm like tapped in here, bro. This is like just one of the most chaotic games I've ever seen. Oh, I went for it, bro. You know what, Rakan? You deserve the kill. You deserve the kill on that. I miss. I, I, I griefered. All right, second item we're going to be going for Storm Surge. Uh, Lux is one of the very few supports that can actually proc this. Because basically, the only other real champions that would ever buy it are like Brand and Zyra. And so much of their damage doesn't come out immediately, but like after the fact. But Lux's combo, if you get hit by a Q, the majority of her combo damage is coming out in the next like two seconds. And that's your timer for Storm Surge. You have to deal 35% of a champion's max health within 2.5 seconds to, to, to proc it. So it is, it is very much a burst item, and not many supports can like put that level of DPS out that fast. All right. Uh, Pushing my limits. See if we can go kill this Trundy Poo. Might be on a ward somewhere. See, see if he'll. See if you can bait him. On a ward. On a ward. Let me know, bro. Oh. Easy. An ally has been slain. All right. We got this wave in. Oh, I like I, I like this dragon. Need to be down there for that. Dude, I have never been this fed on Lux. This is actually like so much fun. I'm like three levels down on my top lane and I guarantee you I'm doing more damage than him. Oh. The Dragoon. See what you got, Skarner. Oh, they're going all in on this guy. Oh, maybe. Oh, big hole. Oh, oh. Uh. Um. Okay. One down. Down. You got Yasuo. Oh, that would have been so cool if I predicted where he was backing. I'm dead. Yeah. Fortunately, Briar with one item is just crazy cracked when she finds that ambush angle. Uh, Lux has some pretty decent counterplay against Briar, though, because unless she, like, finds me jumping out of a bush like that or over a wall, I can always, if she presses W, she's running at you in a straight line, which makes it very easy for both of our champions, actually. Like, Kate can set a trap down right where she's running. I can throw a Q right where she's running. It's super easy. I just got very greedy looking for the, uh, the kill on Yasuo. Guys, I am 10 and 2. What is going on, bro? We need to play more Lux, man. We need to play way more Lux. Oh, you know what? I've actually been having, like, a blast doing those. You, you've probably seen some of them. Doing like three hour uh, movie videos. Let me know if you guys want to watch a Lux movie. I'm dead. Oof, missed everything. And they're just like all literally sticking around as five, I guess. We need to, we need to be a little bit more careful or just like. We need to be more careful in how we approach them or just like push somewhere else, honestly. Like, Kate's got the right idea, I think. Your turret has been destroyed. Yeah, this is a really fun, really, really fun champion, though, especially when you get this fed. Alright, I want to show you guys some more one shots, so we need to play a little smarter for that to happen.
Your team has destroyed a turret. The superior tactic is to never give up. All right. Also, we can go for... Oh, 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 my God. We can go for, um, Zonia's for a third item. I think that would be really, really good here. That's actually insane. I got to shut down off that, too. So we'll start stacking that boy, bad boy. We'll start building towards it. Caitlyn is dead. But that's okay because we're the carry. She's just my sidekick. What's this guy going for? Is he going for the escape or is he going for... Hello. Oh, there's my ping spiking back up again. Just ult the wave so she starts taking turret damage. Save the turret. The world has seen enough darkness. All right. Uh, don't take this guy. See us. We chillin', we chillin'. We're at that weird part of the game where we're like definitely objectively ahead. We're not so far ahead that like we can just do whatever we want. Like it's really actually hard to like take these tier two turrets against their champions unless we just like five man group. Okay. Unfortunately, I mean, I, I understand why he did it, but T the fact that Tebow kept running made me miss my ulti. Briar can't dodge, so if Timo just stands still, my ult kills him there and probably saves him. But I understand. He had, he had a Briar on top of him. Of course, he's going to keep running. All right, my Ludent has already done 1,400 damage. Uh-oh. Did I greed? Chillin', we chillin'. Dodge that. Slow him there. This guy's gonna keep chasing me because he's a bozo. Get him with the slow. Auto. Q. Oh, come on. No, oh, my squall got him. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, I think this champion might be for sadistics. S sadists. Um. Good luck, my friend. Oh. Nice, right, so we get free dragon off that. Dude, holy god, I'm 15 and 3. Shield up my squad, shield up my homies. Got that guy slush. <gasps> no shot, we just got out smited by Rakan, man. That was beyond Chad. That was beyond Chad. On his exchange, smite to ignite. That that's crazy. I mean, he's got unsealed spellbook. Did he have a smite? He 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 must have. That was just nuts, bro. What a beast. I'm not I'm not even mad. Like I'm a little mad. Like I'm mad, but like I'm not mad. I'm impressed. I'm mad. You know what I mean. All right, uh... She's got, um... Got spell shield. I hate that. I hate that, bro. I got exhausted. If I didn't get exhausted, I think I could have had the movement speed to uh, actually get out there. 
Oh, ult him under turret. Ult him under turret. Big ulti. Big ulti. He's got no follow up though. Oh, it's so sad. We got a group like them. This would be a big bummer of a game to, uh, to lose, guys. Okay. Okay, I see. Okay, it worked out. We can actually just Baron off that. We can do this. In Baroon. Ellis. The superior Baroon. Is to never give up. The jungle is dead. They're catering his bot. I didn't even realize their Briar is almost as bad as me. Just ulti this. My ult is basically a, a non-existent cooldown. So it's 30 seconds, like who cares? It'll be back up soon. Also, if you want to play for more ulti-centric build, you can definitely go CDR boots and ultimate hunters are secondary. However, Inspiration does have a slightly higher cooldown. I think the Inspiration tree is just like OP. Biscuits and Cosmic. Just very, very solid setup at the moment. All right. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Dude, where's my peel, man? Peel, please. They're, they're just running at me. Like, literally, all their champions can do is run at me. So, if I just have, like, my Skarner next to me and they can't do that, they have no play. Scar, Scar, sit on me. Oh, I wish I wish that Trundle would have died, man. I might have been able to survive. I think I missed my Q, though. Eh, we'll, eh, we'll, we'll blame it on the pain, guys. Shall try? My man. That's all I can ask, guys, that, that he tries. I'm gonna demolish this turret in one hit. All right. Stop his back. Oh, you're not allowed to ping your teammates anymore. So I can't tell her to ult him. Amazing change, right? I love not being able to communicate with my team. All right. Skarner says he's going to peel me, so he should be good. Yeah, see, th things are a lot easier when they don't just, like, immediately run for me. Uh... Oh my god. Yo, I don't know where I'm allowed to stand, bro. I feel like I'm standing pretty far back here. That briar is just immediately... Racking my skull. I only got one. It's not too bad. Enemy triple kill. What a fiesta game, bro. What an absolute fiesta of a game. Oop, five like them at all times, IMO. Hmm. I don't know about this one, fella. Well, he got them off dragon. Maybe... Maybe? I have to zone use that, or else, uh... Dude, I can't hit the freaking blast cone. All right, I'm starting to tilt, man. Can we get on the same page? The second I walk into a fight, five people run at me. 
Okay, let's stop going in one by one and group at all as five at all times. Do not go anywhere that I'm not, please. Just, if, if they just like walk me in five mid, like I, I can I can one shot someone and then we can get the turret. Problem is like we're split in like three places, and they just all have go buttons, like every single one of them. Actually, let's, let's, let's go bot, let's stop this trundle, and then we can go mid. Wait, can we just ult this, or well, like, what's going on? Like, why, why are we chasing if we're not going to ult? There we go. There we go. There we go. Alright, bye mid. Come now. Let's go. Let's go. Through top lane. Going mid. Okay, there's wind wall. There's wind wall. Getting in there, boys. I'm getting there. My zone is up in five seconds. I just need to zone is the briar stun. It's a celestial opposition. It's got Yasuo's passive. Half health the Rakan. Ah, it's a doomer, bro. Look where Yas look, look where Yone went, man. All right, Yone doesn't want to win. Enemy quadra kill. I don't know, bro. Like, it's just, it's so easy. Just walk me in, guys. Just walk me up to the turret. Why not push waves, then fight? Because we, that hasn't worked all game. That hasn't worked a single time. Just do what is working, which is grouping as five. Give in hip, give in hip. Uh oh, he's committing. Uh oh. Alright, he's dead now. Hmm. Kind of kind of crazy. We're I think we're gonna lose this game. Huh? Alright, we need we need Baron. We need Baron off this. They got inhib. We even duo it? I actually don't even know. gonna be trundle contesting us i think i think maybe it's it's a i'm gonna put this down for a maybe it works maybe we'll see we'll see uh -huh. Yeah, this is, this is a pretty slow Baron. We're at, we're at half, though. Let's trundle. Yeah, you're pulling him out of my E. I'm gonna die to, uh, I'm gonna die to Baron here. We can't do Baron. I mean, it, it doesn't matter. I'm not, I'm not even gonna type to my D anymore, because, like, we're not listening. We're not listening, so if I even type to him, you know. I'm just gonna take a reset here. Uh, I don't have enough mana for my ult. <laughs> Bummer. Um, I think I'll just keep running here. Should be fine. Unless she comes this way and doubles over the wall. Okay, they won't be able to end the game here. Oh, uh, we gotta go contest them on Dragon. I think Briar's just gonna solo that too fast for me.
Man, what it what, like create? It's actually insane that we. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Briar went top. Nice, nice, nice. They did not do the dragon. Dragon, dragon, dragon first. Listen, li guys, listen. Just listen to me, bro. I, like, I'm, tr I'm telling you how to win the game. Just listen to it. It's so easy. It should be so easy. Should have just ulted that guy. Okay. Trying to do Baron, but Timo got her off it. Wait. Okay, reset, reset, reset. That's good. They can't do it well with, with, with three people contesting. Just don't die, don't die. Don't die, please. Don't die. Okay, so all you have to do is not die. Don't. Guys, they're chasing them into their jungle. Why are they doing that? <gasps> oh my god, my team won a fight. Wait. I love my team. They're the best. My team's the best. Let's go. Uh, oh my god, we're doing four different things. Oh my god, what are we doing? All right, let's just let's just get top end hip, I guess. I don't think we can end the game. Is the thing. And maybe we can. Maybe we can. And in my ult. Okay. Wait, we can actually end. We can actually end. Good job. Good job. Good job. Trundle needed to play under his turrets there. He played under his turrets, he actually won that. Okay, Briar's gonna be here. I gotta land this Q. I have to land this Q. I'm hitting Nexus, bro. I'm hitting Nexus, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on, minions. Let's go! Oh my god. That ended up being such a stressful game, man. It was just one of those games where I was unbelievably fed, but I was a little laggy, and then also team was just like kind of grief. It doesn't matter. A dub's a dub, boys. We got it. Let's take a look at that damage chart. 51,000 damage coming out of luck support. There it is, guys. You want to know why she's broken? That's why she's broken. My ADC did... Wow. It's okay. Uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the game as much as I enjoyed playing it for you. Take it easy, boys. Peace. Uh...